hundred dollars and time served. Stupid anti-pimping laws. Well, pay the man. Bender, honey, we love you. Shut up, baby, I know. Oh, no, 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 no. Shut up, baby, I know it. I did not expect to laugh like that, man. <laughs> Why did he have a go to? Look, no go to? Go to! <laughs> Is this. Let me rewatch this. If I tag along, I got him. Whoa, whoa, hold up. So if she got, oh, okay, 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 okay. I, I like it. I like it. I like it. Okay. And a B bar, a C card. So what's A? And what's what's D? This car has everything a beautiful woman like me needs. Why does Victor she talk said like so. <laughs> no dog food for Victor tonight. Bro, you in a you in a projects? <sighs> I better turn on the heater too. Not the AC and the heater simultaneously. Hey, tell me something. You've got all this money. How come you always dress like you're doing your laundry? I guess because my parents keep telling me to be more ladylike. Anyone spend the night together? No. no. Yep. Kind of. <gasps> oh, oh my god it's working they think we're making out <laughs> you're so good wait why aren't we making out I don't know. <laughs> oh my god Fry, i really like hanging out with you Aww. everything why is going great like so fry you busy tomorrow there isn't that enough okay sure what do you want to do for valentine's day oh so, so all of a sudden we're was anybody hurt no 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 of course not Nobody but you. Oh, what was it you wanted to talk about before we crashed, anyway? Ooh, imagine, oh, imagine! Dad. You gonna break up with her now, bro? <laughs> Attached to her body? That's tough. That's tough if he does that. Ooh. He's risking, he's risking his life if he does that. Yeah, it's pathetic, all right. Lisa, why are you there? <laughs> why are you there? How much? 500 oh. bucks. Done. Mine's date. What business is it of yours? Right, what does it and matter? another thing, you're using an awful lot of makeup there. This is deodorant. What does it do? Come what on does in, it Gary. Do? I'll just meet your future husband, Sal. Gee, nice eyeball, eyeball. Nice ass, ass. Ooh, sparks. I don't really like coffee. Neither do I. Ooh, I feel a little tipsy. What? Thank With the you. Out. Good looking out. And if I ever feel lonely, I can just look over at this disfiguring scar and think of you. She okay with that? Okay. My ass! My beautiful! Oh no! <laughs> Perfect. So, this was, this was really funny. This was really funny, man. I don't know why I have like so much energy right now, but I do, y'all. I feel great. I feel excited. I feel like I can conquer the world. Maybe because I've been working out. I've been working out. You know, I try. Listen, listen, listen. Guys, I used to be so athletic. I kid you not. 20, what? I don't know. When I was, when I was 18, right? When I first, when I first went to college at 18, when I went to college at 18, right? I was like, hey, I was like two, at that time I was two, uh, I want to say 220. I was, and I just thought to myself, like, Man, I gotta lose weight, man. This is this is gross. So like, I just go walking everywhere. My campus was a huge campus. I went to uh, University of Illinois, and the campus was like the size of a metropolis. And so to get to my from my dorm to one of my classes in the North Quad, it would take about twenty five to thirty minutes to walk there. So I would leave my dorm at least a half hour to forty five minutes in advance just to be able to walk there and be a little bit early for class um 
you know, and that's that's the path I took my freshman year. It helped me. A lot of people gain the freshman 15. I lost the freshman 30. I don't know if that's a thing, but I lost 30 pounds my freshman year. I was pretty proud. I, By the time I went back home to my parents' house uh, during winter break, because that's the first time I went back home since summer, um, I was... No, actually, I did go back home for Thanksgiving break, I think. Yeah, I think I went home for Thanksgiving break. Anyways, my point is, I lost a lot of weight. I got in shape right back then, and I increased my vertical. You know, I'm only I'm only five eleven, so six feet on a good day, but you know, five eleven on a bad day. Anyways, I increased my vertical. I got really strong. I was finally able to dunk. Also. I was just really in the best shape of my life, man. And honestly, I want to return to that shape. So this week, I started working out again. I haven't worked out. I kid you not. I haven't worked out in years. Like, it's been literal years since I actually just either went to a gym or worked out by myself at home. I did push-ups for the first time since, like, 2018. That's just how long it's been, man. It's, it's pretty disgusting. It's pretty disgusting. I tried doing just 10 push-ups, right? At five, I was struggling. I'm like, what happened? I used to be able to do hundreds. I can't even do five? I, I, and then I, then it all came, it all, it all, it all made sense. That's why I've been so like mentally out of it. Like, the way I view myself has affected my energy throughout my life. Like I view myself, when I look in the mirror, I see this guy and I'm like, all I, all, all I think about is you gotta get in shape. That's literally all I think about every time I look in a the mirror, there's actually a mirror right there. There's my phone right there and I can see myself, but I'm looking at a mirror over there on that wall and I just think to myself, you didn't used to look like this. Your face used to be slimmer, you know, Everything was different. I gotta get in shape, man. I gotta. It's gotta be the year. 2021 is the year. Slash 2022, hopefully. Anyways. Why did I why did I bring that up? What was my point? My energy. My energy has improved a little bit because I was just working out like a few days ago. And I'm probably gonna work out again today, you know, in between like recording sessions. And I realize this, this must be why I'm so excited to watch Futurama. Cause I swear like last time I reacted, my energy probably like, was was I this energetic last time? Let, let me know, like, I, I'm pretty sure I wasn't. I'm pretty sure I wasn't. Now, anyways, I love this episode. This episode was, I'm probably gonna edit all that out for, for uh, to, for YouTube, because I know they're gonna be like, "Man, why you talk so much?" So I know some people probably be getting so irritated. They probably be hitting dislike, like, "Man, this dude always talking, man." Dislike, click off the video. Like, hey, some people probably be savages like that. It is what it is. But this episode was full of was pretty iconic in my opinion. I got to see the line that I actually knew of before I before I um you know watch Futurama. I got to see the line. Uh, what do you say? What are you, uh, what are you saying? Sh shut up, baby. I know. Like, I got to see that line. I heard of that line in a meme, like, a few years ago. And I think I used it in one of my other reactions just because I knew of the meme and of the show it came from. But it had no context for me. You know, I hadn't seen the episode that it came from. Saw the episode. It was it was it was fire. It was fire. It was a banger. Put your head on my shoulders. Fry his head literally on uh, Amy's shoulder because of an accident. I, I don't know what really happened to his body. They didn't really like specify what happened to his body. Just that he got in an accident, you know. And I, we're kind of left to pick up the pieces and the details. But um, you know. With that being said, like Fry, Fry was able to pull through, and we got to see some an iconic line from Bender uh, as a joke, like a little cutaway. Futurama, they're not 
they're not like Family Guy with their cutaways. Like they don't cut away to like a completely different like kind of universe type setting. Uh, they'll like cut away to just another scene. Like it, it'll be like a flashback type cutaway, you know. And it'll it'll be it, it's it's usually cool. It's usually cool. So it's, it's always cool actually. I, I like it. But I love this episode a lot. It was very hilarious. It was full of jokes, like delayed jokes, like jokes where like you knew it was coming and they, what the, and they kind of flirted with the, with the idea of the joke and they're like, are, are, are they really going to pull it? Are they, are they going to, are they going to have, you know, intercourse? You know, like, like Stewie Griffin. I'm going, going to, to have, have intercourse with you. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. yeah. Intercourse with you. You know what I mean? Are they going to have intercourse? Like, or are they not? You know, picking, you know, picking flower petals. You know, will, will he, will he have sex with me? Will he not? Will he have sex with me? Will he not? Will he have sex? You know what I mean? Like, and eventually they did. Like, they pulled a couple of those uh, delayed type of jokes in this episode. And I loved both of them. I mean, both of them. <laughs> this episode was just, it was really hilarious for me, man. It was really hilarious. And anybody who didn't like it, like, click off, bro. Why are you here? <laughs> Why <are> you? <laughs> you gotta go. Anyways, Futrama is great one of the greatest animated series i've ever seen i've seen adventure time and for me adventure time is definitely number two at first it was number one um but there's another show that's number one that i y'all 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 will see y'all will see we'll see if we'll see we'll see how the youtube uh we'll see okay without uh getting into too many spoilers i I really want to continue. I love how Leela was there for uh, for Fry in the end. She was not really willing to help him out in the beginning. She wasn't willing uh, because honestly, Fry had a good thing going. He had a very good thing going with uh, Amy, and he ruined it. I feel like she was a great girl, but you know he. He didn't really want to be with her. His heart wasn't in it. His heart wasn't in that relationship. You know, I've been there. I've been there. Like, there have been... I'm pretty sure a lot of people have been there. Where someone like you or... You like someone just a little bit or something. Or let's say, let's say someone liked you, right? Someone likes you and you may not like them as much. And so, to you, you know, their actions are kind of overbearing their efforts in the progressive friendship slash relationship, their efforts are unwanted and unnecessary. And to you, it comes off as overbearing. And I mean, I've been there. I completely understand how far I felt. So it's like, I get why he did it. But at the same time, I was still sad for Amy. I was still sad because she looked genuinely happy, man. She looked genu genuinely happy. And when he broke the news to her, like, she was down. She was down a little bit. But she's not, she's definitely not that type of character to be down for a long time. Like how, you, like how Leela was, like, down about, uh, Nibbler. About Nibbler being flushed down to the sewers. Leela was down about that for, what, five, five to ten minutes? Like, a good portion of the episode was about Leela being down about Nibbler, right? Amy, next second after a breakup. So, hey, do you mind if I ask this other guy? What? What? Was there another guy the whole time? You know what I mean? Like, there, hey, there are people like that who just, they move on quick. You know, their 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 uh, regenerative abilities are are maxed out. You know, they're, they're like, you know, gear 15. Ge regenerate, uh, regeneration abilities. You know what I mean? Like, maxed out potions you know like they, they got it but great episode for me great episode i really love futrama it's it is definitely shaping up to be i think i've said this in a previous reaction but it's shaping up to be a top five top five animated series of all time for me all right but i am gonna get into the next episode guys y'all hear them birds outside that should tell you what time it is right now <laughs> that should tell you what time it is i should not be up i should be asleep but I'm up. I'm listen. 
I'm at that point right now where I just kind of sleep whenever, bro. And if I'm not sleep, I'm recording. Like, that's just how my days go. If I'm not sleep, I'm recording or editing. I, that's what I'm doing. So we're gonna be recording Futurama today. All right, we're gonna be recording Futurama today. And then after we record, probably friends.